I understand for some people this place would feel far too creepy and outdated. But for us, it's a place where we can escape from all the noise and pollution. Simple country living at its best. Well, it could be if I also grew my own food and had some chicken for eggs and goats for milk here. But that's too much responsibility and hard work, as my main focus currently is creating content for all my channels. Plus, on the top of all that, I need to do and make things so that I have something for my content. That's enough work, man. Cheers, guys. Cheers to creations. Oh my god, it's squeaky. This just reminds me that <laughs> that's how I will be in a couple of years' time. Very squeaky. As I move my extremities. But not just yet, man. I'm not that old. But I mean, I really enjoy creating things. You know, if I could do this for the rest of my life, just create things, then uh, I would be very happy. Yeah. And uh, mainly like upcycling, just turning around like the old and the ugly, making into a beautiful swan. It's, it's, it's just so satisfying. And uh, that's probably what we're gonna do next. Another outdoor project. It's been good few years me creating things, so wherever you look, you will definitely find something handmade. Hence this place becoming so special every day. Okay, now follow me. I mean, follow me on Instagram and subscribe to all my other channels as well. All the links you can find in the video description. This is my barn, which has been built by the previous owner as a garage, but I just could not see potential it becoming my art studio slash workshop from where I can create whatever comes in my crazy mind despite the weather. Well, since last time, not much has changed, but believe me, I am working hard to make it all cool and awesome. You will get to see the progress in the upcoming videos here, as well as on my art channel. And come on, who else has a personal catwalk? Who? Yep, yeah, it's so cool. But let's leave that for the next time, as now there was something I needed to do. Hmm, my breakfast. Freshly baked cotton cheese balls. Ponchike in Latvian. Mm. We are out with the van for change. Oh my god, I haven't driven van for I think two months now. Uh, yeah, but it was technical inspection day and yeah, we passed. 
Of course we passed. So, yeah, we are ready to go again. If we want to, do we want to, and when we want to. Anyways, it's not, it's not really, oh, I need to close the door. It's, uh, nothing is really happening in here still. When do you think, guys? You probably think when when I will make this new design and, and, and get it ready for the this winter's traveling. Well, it's not it's not hard. It's not uh, it's not gonna take that much because I'm gonna just put simple structures in. Um, you know, uh, all it's missing is a bed, bed in a new way. Uh, bed and a shelf that's it only will take like a day two days work that's it so yeah i like to go with the flow and i like to follow the energy you know and if i feel like on that day like creating something i need to do it and i will do it and um, i will have so much fun with it i'm actually enjoying taking time off from driving the van I think mainly because I have to take a lot of gravel roads every day and they are so bumpy and incredibly dusty with which my van doesn't cope well. So it was back to driving the Jeep for now and wow I can now drive roads I couldn't drive before. <laughs> Chicken skin, yeah? Chicken skin. And I am having sourdough bread with hazelnuts and dried fruits inside. This is so delicious, especially with butter on it. So yeah, mmm. Got some water. Snoopy's got some water here. Mmm. Nami and Sam is out. So many apples. So many apples. But not only apples, but also the grass grows back so fast. Literally, you can just put the chair out and sit there with your popcorn whilst watching it grow. Is that crazy? Yes. Well, to be honest, it's much nicer to see the green rather than mud or never-ending snow. And Snoopy just loves spending time in his grass. Bless him. But I like to see the yard tidy, so I trimmed it all nicely. Wow. 
was a hard work, man. Then I still had to do that side of the garden there and there. And also the other side of the fence where my trees are planted. That's a lot of grass to cut, man. Plus I have two fields as well. But those the neighbor kindly does for me with his tractor. Thanks God for that. And this side. Don't know if they live there. Need to fix that glass as well. Uh, you want to see what's in the greenhouse? In the greenhouse, it's a different story. I didn't even bother to cut the grass there. Uh, because I don't need to get in there. Why? Why would I go in there? It's crazy. Look. It's all overgrown. And same here. I'm not growing any tomatoes this year. I don't care. This looks nice. It's called greenhouse for a reason. It's green in there. Yeah. That's a big football pitch for you, isn't it? Me? Thank you. That's a good boy. That's a big football pitch for you. Woo! Good job. But really, what we can play here? An apple ball. Have you seen an apple ball? Snoopy? See the apple tree? It just gives so much shade during the whole day. And the more towards evening it comes, the bigger the shade. So needed in hot weather like this. Oh, so nice. So many apples, which are not rotten yet. These ones are the best. They are so delicious. So delicious. Can't stop eating apples. I'm keeping this one in control. So I'm letting it grow, but keeping it in control. Rolling, 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 rolling. 
And wow, we again been spoiled with plenty of sunshine and hot temperatures this summer. One just cannot help but get the bikini out and fetch some vitamin D. But before I could do that, I just needed to get this done. Sometimes I wish I had hand-free camera, but yeah, we got there eventually and then it was a well-deserved me time. I just love this when there's nothing too much planned and you can just take it easy and slowly. Nowhere to rush, nothing to conquer. Simply be in the present moment pottering around your property doing the little things. Spending time with your dog, maybe remembering nice people whom you want to surprise with a box of fresh apples when you go for a drive. And simply just enjoy yet another sunny day. Summer won't last forever. Well, not in this part of the world anyway. So yeah, keeping that in mind, it's easier to appreciate all those little things in life. And although I like to go on an adventure, I equally like spending time in my own space. <laughs> 